Good morning, my fellow YouTubers. Um, I want to say good morning to you. It is election day. Um, it is Sunday morning, about 11 o'clock. Early voting. Well, early voting. Um, we're here um, in Jacksonville, and I'm just up, out and about this morning. I want to first say thank you to all of my subscribers and um, my new sisters, uh, Stephanie, Sarita, Vicky, um, my my special friend Margaret, um, um, Koki. Hey, Koki. Um, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness there's so many of you if i forget your name i'm sorry but i just want to say thank y'all and thank you for your support thank you for watching my channel i haven't made a video in a while i did make one yesterday about my um florida gators inspired look of course the gators lost but still i'm still a diehard gator gators for life and you can see my husband still wearing his gator shirt and he went to the game yesterday, y'all, and he was he had a ball, and I was so happy for him. Um, but we're out and about this morning. We're going to go and pick up a few things, and we're going to um, clean out the car. Um, this is the week, y'all, for me to move. I will be moving on Friday, and I'm excited, and we've come to the conclusion, like I said, we're getting rid of everything, y'all, starting from scratch. You know, it's just something inside of you at a certain point in life where you just want to start over. Not that my life has been all 100% bad. No, it has not. But you get sometimes a renewed spirit, a renewed mind, and you get on a different path. And that's where we are. And we're looking to do better and be better. And um, I want to live healthy, you know. And with my son having so many allergies, a lot of the materials that we have, he's allergic to. So instead of just going through this long, drawn-out process of finding, continuing to try to find out what he's allergic to, we're just going to start over. And um, if that means getting rid of everything, that's what we're going to do. We just My husband was just saying he wished he could just take the clothes on his back and just leave everything else. So we pretty much we're going to do that, but... Um, we're going to take a few things, but it's a fresh start, and I'm looking forward to it, and y'all just, I ain't going to say wish me luck, because I don't believe in luck, because all of our lives have already been laid out before us, and only God knows what tomorrow holds, and if I continue to trust him and have faith and seek him first, I know that he will guide me in the right direction. I just have to continue to pray that I don't not listen to him or not be on the same page with him. Um, for those of you that find joy in leaving negative comments and being mean and hateful, I could do the same, but I choose not to. What I'm going to do is pray for you. I know that at one point in my life, I was so damaged that anything negative may have sent me into a shell or made me feel, you know, defeated, but not now. I had a comment, y'all. I talked about my brother and his case. And like my husband told me, yes, some of the things that that we say when we feel like we're telling a person why we've done something, it comes out as being an excuse. I have no excuse. I have my own reasons. And that's my prerogative. You know, my brother know I love him. Um, but when it comes to my health and my sanity, I gotta choose me first and um, it's not that he didn't have support because he has his mother and he has the rest of his family and my, my children when I couldn't be there my children were there not only to send messages but to send my love and um, I've written him a letter because he left going back to um, Stark Florida before I could actually talk to him on the phone because once he leaves, we can't have any um, conversations with him on the phone. So uh, that's how that goes. But he knows I love him. Um, that's my brother. 
you know, and I, I was so happy to hear that um, things turned out the way that they did. Now, to all of you that have people that are incarcerated or going through something right now, I ask you to continue to pray for them. You know, if you need to leave, um, if we need to start having some prayer sessions or we come together at least once a week, twice a week, and leave comments and prayers and touch and agree, that's what we have to do. Because no matter whether we make wrong decisions or right decisions, we all still need God in our lives. Sometimes it takes something to happen sometimes for, for people to wake up and, and see what life is all about. And um, we're not all, we're not perfect. There's only one perfect, one perfect being, and his name is Jesus Christ. And he died, he gave up his life so that we may live and that we may have the victory. And um, so we count it all as done. We have the victory. No matter what we go through, the days get hard. We get confused. We get our feelings hurt. Um, we get angry. We get upset. All of these kind of things. But trust and believe that God knows all. He hears all. He sees all. But we have to just continue to trust him and seek him first. And it's easy. it seems like sometimes it's easy for me to say that, just trust him and seek him first. Because I know how sometimes I get in a storm and I just get to the point where sometimes I don't know what to say. You know, but I do know that I can raise my hand toward the sky and God knows and he sees and hears me and he feels my pain. And when the tears fall, he will come to my rescue. He will come to my rescue. He always dries my tears. And he gave me a sense of peace, no matter what's going on. So right now I ask um, for all of you that are sick or may have something that's going on inside of you, that whether it's depression, whether it's anxiety, whether it's an illness, um, even if it's a physical, something that's physical that can be seen, we're going to pray that God continue to heal us and send us all the help that we need to make it from one minute to the next one second to the next because nothing in life is guaranteed or promised to us so things can change at the blink of an eye so god i continue to pray and ask you to help my friends and my enemies in their lives to guide them to keep them to strengthen them to change them into the people that you desire for them to be it's not about what we want it's about what God, what his plan is. And whether we understand it or not, his will shall and will be done. Whether we want it or not, it's going to be done. So, I just thank him today. I thank him on this Sunday morning. And no, I didn't go to church today. But you know, I always keep God in my mouth and in my heart. I do my Bible study and I read. And until I find a church home, another church home, um, this is what I'll do. You know, I'm learning, y'all. I'm learning. You never stop learning. God is good. When I say he's good, he worked things out. Ooh. Y'all, I just had him. Ooh, goodness. Thank you, Lord. I haven't taken my medicine yet, but I'm going to take it. But um, I'm getting a little excited. But I uh, thank you, Lord. I do. So y'all be blessed. Um, we're here. I'm going to clear out the car at the moment. Um, I got my little outfit of the, of the day. It's nothing spectacular, something casual. Just thank you want to film me right quick. Just got on my little shorts, my little Hershey shirt. So y'all, y'all be blessed. Trust in the Lord. Seek Him, y'all. And it's gonna be okay. Sarita, girl, you know I'm with you. You know I got you. Whenever you need me, call me. Stephanie, whenever you need me, call me. Margaret, you know I'm gonna hear from you, and you gonna hear from me. Vicky, hey baby, that's my girl, Vicky. That's my sister from another mister. Um, Koki, thank you so much. Thank you for 
even taking the time out to even click, you know, onto my videos, y'all. I'm not doing anything spectacular. It's just my life, you know. And um, I don't know what God is going to do. But I thank him, and I thank him for each and every one of you. And I pray that your day is blessed in every single way. Y'all come find me on Facebook. Send me some messages. We can talk and chit-chat. Y'all know I love to run my mouth. And it's all good, y'all. I send y'all love, peace, and hair grease. Y'all take care. Love you. Bye.